My first job in commercial TV after school was at WCJB TV 20 for $4.85 an hour. Get $4? What was, what was the job? I should have known oh my that, gosh. Jennifer. I should have known. Isn't that like less? Was that minimum wage at the time? Or? I assume. I mean, it does oh. go back a few days. We were talking about 1996. So, uh, you know, I don't know what the legalities of it were, but that was the wage uh, as a photographer. And just an interesting side note, at that time, you know, I wanted to be a sports broadcaster. I knew that. And I said, this is my end goal. Will you ever, if somebody's on vacation, somebody else is sick, will you ever give me a chance to do sports? No, never. You will never do sports at the station. Okay, that's fine. So that's 1996. Uh, I was I was at TV 20 as a photographer for about four months or so, three, four months. Went up to Savannah, Georgia. Jennifer hit the big time, $8.50 an hour. Uh, that was to be a photographer and a one-man band reporter. And then I got my first job in September of 1996 in Mobile, Alabama. I was there for three years. And at the end of those three years, I went back to where? Gainesville TV 20, where they told me I would never do sports to be their sports director. What changed your mind, you think? Like, was it a change in management or? Uh, you know, there were some adjustments. And I think, you know, when you get out and you start proving it, now all of a sudden you have a real, instead of a fresh-faced kid, kid out of college, now at least there's, there's a resume line or two. There's, a, you know, a, a reel behind you to support what you said that you would do. That's why um, you should never say never, because, like, it could come and bite you in the ass later, you know? Truly, uh -huh. truly. So uh, I was there for seven and a half years before I got, um, you know, what I considered at the time a, a big break. To, to work in a market that I really wanted to work in, which was Tampa. And I went to Bay News 9 and Bright House Sports Network, and I was there for three years. I would have spent the rest of my career there. I love that part of the state. I love that part of the country. I love the pro sports, the college sports that we covered at that time. Unfortunately, towards the end of my third year, they uh, I was the second of about eight layoffs. Um, we were all replaced by people who made half as much. Much like the job that paid $4.85 an hour, this should have been a flashing knee on yes. time. Get out of this crazy. But you ran, you ran towards the danger. You're like a firefighter. Well, yeah, not as brave, perhaps, but I did run screaming towards it, yes. 